Now at noon, a big drug ring taken down. Investigators in Volusia County announcing they've seized large amounts of methamphetamine while arresting several suspects. They say the whole operation was being led by a former Florida corrections officer. Thanks for joining us this noon. I'm Bridget Ellison. And I'm Justin Warmoth. Let's get right out to News 6's Molly Reed live at the sheriff's office where deputies just gave an update on this. Molly? Well, Justin, the sheriff's office says this ring was led by a former state prison guard. They said that during this investigation, they seized almost a pound and a half of meth plus other drugs they say would have made it into the hands of thousands of users. Now, it says the majority of the 10 people facing charges for it were found in DeLand, but others were in Ocala and other parts of Central Florida. It says the investigation actually started back in March, but search warrants in June led them to finding the ringleaders. Now, Volusia, Volusia Division Chief Brian Henderson says the former prison guard, Christina Guest, spent 12 years working for the state but was fired almost a decade ago since then he says this is now the second time she's been arrested for drug selling or related charges he says her supplier this time was found in ocala he says this is just one example though of a larger problem they're battling right now in our area the two biggest threats fentanyl being the number one threat um, with meth following closely behind it the, the amount of seizures that we've had just in, in our the sheriff's office um, over the past couple of years have tripled with meth. And that's the street level deputies doing car stops, seizing meth, large quantities of meth out of, out of vehicles. Now, again, 10 people altogether were, are facing charges in this. He says one of the women also facing charges in this is under questioning, too, after investigators found her baby dead with meth in its system. He says right now she's just under questioning. She's not facing charges for that, but he says that the Volusia Sheriff's Office is working with state prosecutors to make sure someone is held responsible for it. In Daytona Beach, Volusia County, I'm Molly Reed getting, getting results, News 6.